many drinks you wanna pour? Make it enough to bag the win and take it home. How many links to double up the drinks? How many bandos can one girl handle? That's a lot, that's a lot. Take a shot, take a shot. For your future, for your past. For the scar and all the mass. For the real ones who support. Get your class up, we gon' light it up like here we go. Oh, oh, oh. It's for the folk Who want to stand the toast Pour up, pour up some more Hustlers and shine It starts off with the time is now I okay. think that there's no better time to start on your goals Than the time that you're standing there right now Tonight, my goal is to get fucked up <laughs> oh, okay. Tomorrow, tomorrow we start We start 2022 all right, so I've always had a passion with kids. I've always had a passion with uh, getting involved with the community. So that's what I want to do more this year. Uh, if y'all looked at Renika and I's uh, last uh, video that we had on YouTube, it yeah. speaks about the goals that I, I want to pursue. And I hope that you all subscribe. Yeah, subscribe. Oh, subscribe. Oh, 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 uh, yeah, so I would like to get more involved with the community, involved with kids, uh, mentorship, um, and being a better leader, you know what I mean? Yeah. So for the community and for the younger generation coming up. So that's part of my goal this year. Also, my next one is travel. <clears throat> Who don't want to travel, right? Yeah. Take the time out. We're always working. We're constantly working, going, you know, going through the motion, you know, doing a job, this, this, there, and the other. Take time out for yourself. You got to okay. travel. So a, a couple of my goals for traveling is going out of the country twice this year. And I think we have one planned in June. Uh oh, why? Uh, yeah, and then the next one's gonna be further in the uh in the year. But wow, travel, man. You gotta take time for yourself. You gotta take time for yourself and you know, think about what you want. Uh, I got it right here, boat. I'm getting a goddamn boat this year. Hey, I'm yeah. in the boat. Yeah. 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 And that's yeah. on curry. Yeah. 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 Okay. So some of these are some goals and others are dreams, but um, the last thing is going to be healthy living. I know I'm fucking it up right now with my alcohol and shit, but hey, you got you to gotta have some fun sometimes, you know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, but I do want to start um, eating a little healthier and, you know, getting my body right. I want to lose about 10 pounds, get back to a good range. Cholesterol and stuff. Oh, yeah, 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 we'll, we'll get into that. But, uh, so, yeah. <laughs> But yeah, that, that, that's my goal. That's my goals for this year. Um, yeah, yeah. And that's that's pretty much it, man. Goals and dreams, and so I 20, like and I got right here, twenty twenty two to twenty twenty three, because this is only in a one year span. Yes. Let's take it a year at a time, fellas yes. and ladies. Yes. All right, and that's it. I Thank love it. Man. Like, I'm a person that is, like, just straight to the point. Um, it's not so much, I feel like I have a forever goal. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Like, I'm always working on something that is continuous. So, what I have going on here is always going to be family. Mm. Okay. It's always going to be love, which is, uh, <laughs> which is why. We all love tips. It's all good. Yeah. Um, which is why you see the different facial colors because because I'm all about love at the end of the day I'm all about family. I'm all about friends like that's a very important thing to me um, My vision is fashion and artistry um, As you all know like makeup is my thing, you know makeup is is a big thing to me fashion is a big thing to me and it's just something I want to grow within time. Um, I will also want to help people, you know, so all this plays a part in that, like me growing and flourishing into who I am. And even if I'm in my thirties, it doesn't matter mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. because right. there's always room for growth. You You're never too old to grow. And I think that people think when you hit your twenties, that that's it. Like you just got to be who you want to be at that time. But that's not realistic. Like, right. you all. know, even in your thirties, you're still finding yourself. So I think I'm still in the midst of finding what I really want to do in life. 
And the fact that I know what I want to do, which is just spread love and just just put my passion out there, which is fashion and artistry and creativity and love. Like, I think that's just a big thing. This is what life is to me. Like, like just family and just having a visual of things because you're learning as life goes on and you just have to have a vision as each day goes by because you can't think of one day as what that day is. Because guess what? It's more to life. And it's more to life, like it's more to life than what you see. Right, right. It's more than life to what you see. Yeah. Right. You can't just look at a day and feel like this is what this day entails. Right. Because it's more than what that is. You know, especially right. in these That's times. So. I just feel like every day is an inspiration, every day is a vision. You know what I'm saying? And you just if it's not, you have to make it that way. So that's what my ten point, very clear. It's just yeah. straight to the point. And that's what my board represents. And I just wish the best for every single person in this room. And I just want you to follow the video. In this year, um, so for my for my board, my headline was healthy, and as you can see, healthy is in red, and the rest is in black. So that's that bold statement. <laughs> Yeah, I love it. They are just living themselves. 
and I am a Capricorn, and I'm gonna end by by reading what my sign says. It does say, "Be good to yourself, but avoid avoid bickering," because I have a lot of people, and I do know t- tonight that I live in a um, a now that's that's where bickering gets me to a lot of places that I have a lot of unresolved issues with a lot of people because they don't quite understand my personality. Mm-hmm. And that just comes to me being, ha- having this wall of wall just being sheltered out. Um, but it does say, be good to yourself, but a- avoid bickering. Goats begin the year feeling a deep need to be a caretaker and to lead, to lead you to look after everyone but yourself. Speaking freely about your own wants and needs in February, when your planets ensure you will be heard. Finding the humor and the secret to navigating a difficult situation in June, but Capricorn's new moon offers insights that help you to do it. Mm -hmm. Don't fret about your finances in summer when it seems your family budget is stretched to breathtaking point. A windfall is heading your way that will ease difficult circumstances before the autumn leaves change. Mars retrograde in late October leads you to misunderstanding with a friend or partner. Apologize quickly or you could turn a loving relationship into a long, long, a lifelong grudge. Plan a festive okay. event for your nearest and dearest in December is success that, that will on, give you huh? confidence to take on new challenges in New Year. Perfection had had a great fall. I don't want that to happen at all. Um, this is root theory. It also ties into the kids. I want to be like you know the root of their theory. I want to set it up for those. Um, there are also my blessings, so I'm thankful for those. That's where the saves this goes with this. Um, this is a personal goal, like financial wise for me. I would like to save uh, at least five hundred seven. To seven hundred fifty dollars monthly, it's kind of tough, but I bet I can do it. So right here, I got you know I'm thankful for all that. I'm believing in myself. Uh, take time today to be a dad. I love uh-huh. being a dad. Uh, this is real focus. All this goes together. This is a a diabetes cutout. I also have diabetes. This year, I want to plan on uh, maintaining my weight loss between two twenty five and two thirty two. Amen. And I want to get awesome. off of uh, diabetes medicine. So. Yeah, yeah. Yes. I love it. Yeah, I love it. Yeah. I love it. Okay. That's this year I also plan on yeah, purchasing. Yeah. Uh, I want to purchase an eighteen wheeler, so that's also on my plan this year. So mm-hmm. this is also believe in your dreams. Like I say, I'm really dreaming about the health thing. I hate it, so I really want to. It's know tough. How, yeah, yeah, I want mm-hmm. to get that under control. Like I said, this is a cutout about uh, diabetes. It says by 2050, according to the U.S. Census Bureau predictions, minorities from lower income families will make up about one half of all type of cases. So, like, you know, wow, you know, know, know everybody, all of us have somebody in our family with diabetes. So yeah. Like, yeah. 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 It's like a real thing. So. Yeah, especially in the black community. Yeah. Yeah. Right. You know, yeah. it's just like we like to eat. Everything that's not supposed to be eaten, I guess. Yeah. But other, other than that, that's the problem. Really my heart's going on here because uh, I want to remember this week that I did it all. So, but my heart's going to read this week that uh, the cosmos bring surprise romance into your life this week. Do you want it? The star says yes. Financial hiccups are likely thanks to Mercury, Rotograde, 
balance your budget carefully to avoid errors. A friend confides something deeply personal. Understand the secret must always be kept. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
feel like I'm very blessed okay. and I'm very loved because, um, you know, I've, I've come from a family that wasn't, you know, always blessed and that felt the love, but mm. I created my own family mm. that was loved and that's blessed. And um, I feel like I put Rihanna on there because she oh, she came through, she, mm. you know, come from so much and she was very, she overcame all that and she was very outspoken and I feel like that's me. Mm. You know, I'm very outspoken. I've never, you know, tried to hide where I came from, you know. Um, and I feel this picture I just found in the fucking magazine. <laughs> 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 So that's why I love them so much because they show different characters and different traits and whatnot. Uh, I also have the barn with the garden. I love to plant vegetables. I have a green thumb. I have planted lots of things before. Uh, I have chickens. I have fresh eggs. Um, and I, I just love to grow things. I love to put love into things. I love to nurture things and bring things to life. Not only with wildlife and plants, but also with people as well. 
Uh, I have Tyler Perry here because I kind of look up to him as diversity in acting. He's a character, and I kind of have similar traits to him. And I have also action here too because I love to act, and I want to get back involved with that. Uh, I have these little heads here, and they symbolize me having a more open mind because I grew up in church, and my mind was very closed, and I didn't know a lot of things. And I believe in this season, I my mind is more open and more understanding, and not so judgmental as it was. Um, so I thank God for that. Uh, I have this guy here symbolizing I want to be more stylish. I'm a country boy. I just I dress country. I don't care. If I want to be more stylish and be more confident. And just, you know, be, be more noticeable, you know? I have uh, get to work because I procrastinate a lot. I say I'm going to do stuff and never get to it. So I have that meaning, get to work meaning, get to it. You know, don't wait because time is for nobody. Uh, I have my vision. What happened just to encourage me daily to remember what God put into you. It will manifest into the earth and have purpose. Uh, I also have trust your instincts and thrive. Uh, I have a tough time uh, trusting in my gut. Which I don't know why, but I should. So in this season of my life, I want to trust more what my spirit says and trust what God's saying and have more confidence. Oh. Um, and I have to look fit guy because I want to get in fit for myself and be more healthy. I want to be able to run a marathon. I want to be able to go with my nephews and play football. You know, oh, not be wow. hurt and stuff like that. And uh, yeah, that's it. And also I have elevate. So, Everybody yeah. elevate. Yeah. Also have, yeah. also have this time. Oh, oh, well, oh, yeah. <laughs> So, okay, so I'm kind of break, break like this down into health, self, yeah, ready on that. family, and then work. Okay, so for my vision board, I definitely want to get back more fit, more healthy, you know, because I do want to eventually have kids um, and everything. So I definitely want to work on myself as far as health goes, get back down to a healthy weight per my height and everything like that and i want to go more to nature you know be connected to the earth and really get more organic really be more healthy so that i can live longer and i can educate my family and things like that on what i'm doing and everything and i want to be full of life I want to continue to you know bless others and feed pour into others but you can't pour it to others until you really pour it in yourself. You get what I'm saying? I can't pour it to somebody if I'm injured. You know what I'm yeah. saying? So I'm going to make sure that I'm really being healthy mentally, physically, and spiritually as well. So when it comes to self, I say the tree of life because, you know, you're always growing. And trees have a lot of a, a good root, a good foundation. You know what I'm saying? I always want to be rooted and make sure I'm staying humble. Yep. As I continue to go on and level up, you know, because yes. I definitely feel like <laughs> elevation seems to be the word yeah. going around. So I want to continue to elevate. Um, I definitely want to be more sure. Like all these women here feel it seems very confident. Mm -hmm. Even though it looks as if I'm confident, as a woman, you know, we all have insecurities. Mm -hmm. So you know what I'm saying? So sometimes I battle like, am I good enough? Kind of like what you were saying earlier. Mm -hmm. Am I good enough? Like you know, second guessing, like, am I doing the right thing, you know? So I'm definitely wanting to be more sure of myself, and I'm believing, start to believe, so that I can receive. It starts mm -hmm. from having faith. That way you can really uh, accept what God's giving you. So I want to make sure I'm doing that. So when I go up here, I want to be, become whole with my husband, you know? You know, I'm married and everything. I want to create more memories, want to have kids who are blessed. And I want to continue on loving, like pouring out love to my husband, my family, my friends. Continue to pour into others, you know what I'm saying? Because I'm very passionate on um, uplifting others. So, and here is career. I definitely want to do more women's empowerment um, things. I'm actually working on, um, I have a brunch um, with some ladies now. I'm going to be working towards doing a women's empowerment event yeah. so that's something i've been wanting to do so i'm excited about that um I, I do oprah up here because she's an amazing woman she's very um she speaks well she's very passionate very uplifting and my god she is a black woman who beat that who's a billionaire you understand yeah, he does. Yep. Okay. And, and how yep. how she speaks and stuff like that you know i love interviewing like i'm really passionate about that i never mm -hmm. That I'm really passionate about, about journalism, things like that, but I really am. So I look at her because she's really the 
pioneer for all of that. Nice. After because I love acting, you know, I want to kind of get back into all. that. Yeah. I got a studio here, so I, I really feel see myself leveling it up, being able to be seen by a global, uh, 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 you know, being on networks, having my own network, things yes. like that. You know what I'm saying? I see that for myself, and I definitely see I got fashion here, you know, style and things with them. I'm passionate about those things, too. So I'm a creative individual, so I want to make sure I'm continuing to level up in each area um, as that. And then I also have check-in. So each mm. month I'll be right now things I can check off on what I did. Oh, so I got wow. one through twelve. Wow. You know, we got twelve, you know, twelve oh, months in a year. Scary. So I wanna make sure I'm doing something that I feel like I achieved. Whether it's small or big, I wanna make sure that I'm checking in. You know, you gotta continue to check in on yourself. yourself. I'm challenging myself to make sure I'm holding myself accountable and then I do have to because I'm like, you know, sometimes they, they want to do uplifting or like new faces, things like that. I used to look at that as a child and I was like, oh, I think that would be cool. I always thought it would be cool, but I never saw it manifesting to what I'm doing now and aligning to what I'm doing now. So I feel like this is where I'm meant to be. You know what I'm saying? That's so amazing. So I'm definitely focusing towards that. So the theme here for this year is elevation. Yep. Elevation is the quality or state of being elevated. So like all the goals on here are goals that I started already, like last couple of years, but this is going to be the year that everything comes together. Yeah. So I want okay, self-elevation, I, yes. I want self-elevation, yeah. financial elevation, mm. um, social elevation, and just a lot of self-care. The last couple of years, I've been focusing mostly on work and education, so I'm trying to finish that, you know, I'm writing my dissertation, I have two and a half months to finish it, oh, or a rough draft of it. Yeah. Yeah. So I want to get through that. I want to make sure I learn to live well, you know, get my rest, mm. uh, have time for family and friends, um, make sure I have, like, self-preservation, like, don't, don't feel like, you know, beat <laughs> myself up about certain things, okay? Travel more still, I want vision, I want, um, you know, ownership of a lot of things, a lot of goals that I have, and then I wrote myself a little letter. Mm. Oh, okay. Wow, y'all. So, Beautiful. So I said, Lauren, this will be a year of elevation and completion. You will see the things that you work adamantly yeah, yeah. towards. <laughs> She's beautiful. I work adamantly yeah. towards, come to fruition. And I said, just appreciate them. You know, appreciate the process. Love the process. Um, be still and know that God and like the love of you know, your family and friends will, will help everything come together. I love it. Break out, enjoy the toast. What is hidden for? What you living for? How many of them things make you wanna explore? Where the bag at? We don't cash back. Up, up, up like elevation, good vibration.